Hey, what's going on, YouTube family? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Mark. Please remember to slash that like button and annihilate that subscribe button and hit that post notification bell. Also, leave me comments down below. But I think I've talked enough, so let's just jump straight into these videos. Let's go! They call me Megatron. Johnny's a Megacon. Trying to stop the rise, but the Mexican lives. Hey, I love how that started off. Try to stop the rise, but the Mexican lives. Okay. I want you to stay strong, mamacita. Listen to your mom, okay? Don't worry, daddy's gonna be home soon. I want to pause it right quick, too, because I love how he sat there and started that off by saying that because it, it really fits the name of the, the title of this track being called the day of unity where it's almost sounded like he's trying to unite everyone and put everyone on the same page i definitely like that and i think that that is clever and i love how he's speaking um i'm assuming to his daughter on the, on this track and basically telling her that he'll be home soon i love that like that's 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 dope i like that let me take it back Trying to stop the rise, but the Mexican lives. Carly, I want you to stay strong, mamacita. Listen to your mom, okay? Don't worry, daddy's gonna be home soon. Thinking about my baby girl. Sometimes that's all you can do to get you through those trying times while you locked up. Thinking about my baby girl, growing up by herself in a shady world. She got a good mom and I hope that everything will be fine till I'm home black. Up in this prison can't do much, but my homies in the smile turn to cook lunch. Missing my children, I can't believe what these motherfuckers doing to my family. But I stay strong and I keep my faith, even though I'm thugging till I see my grave. Mama don't. I like that and I love that bar that he sat there and threw in there of basically of sitting there set of, of, of how he highlighted how the system doesn't really sit there and show showcase and utilize what they sit there and do like I sit there and say I've removed myself from the picture because I don't know SPM personally so I don't know his track record or what he did to get locked up all I can know is what I sat there and read I wasn't there so I sit there and separate the artist from what was being said by court cases because I don't know what happened all I know is that there's there's this side, there's this side, and then there's the common side, which is the right side, when you sit there and piece it all together. And I could sit there and say is that a lot of times people tend to dis um to disparage because of what's because of what somebody has how they have lived their life. They try to sit there and be like, okay, well this is how you should be treated or this is how you need to be treated. But I love how he highlighted how the system doesn't showcase what they sit there and do to families when they sit there and lock people up as caged animals and it's like i can't sit there and pass judgment because i don't know spm personally to sit there and say what he did or that he did what he did because i wasn't there but i can sit there and say that he's phenomenal and he's talented and i'm gonna leave it at that so let's just jump back into this And I hope that everything will be fine till I'm home black. Up in this prison can't do much. When my homies in the smile turn to cook lunch. I'm missing my children, I can't believe what these motherfuckers doing to my family. But I stay strong and I keep my faith. Even though I'm thug until I see my grave. Mama, don't worry about your younger son. You should know that I never was the lucky one. Sadness was all that I was still right. Happiness never knew what it felt. Like, but I know I can't be held back like they did me in the sixth grade. Remember that? Oh, I like that. And I love what he 
he sits there and unites on a track with um, when he sits there and brings these female presents. I love that I'm getting back to records where he sits there and does that because it also gives a sense of unity as well. And it also drives home the point that he's trying to make and just trying to unite everybody and bring everyone together and bring them as one and not try to sit there and see differences and not try to judge, if that makes sense. I love that. And I, it just adds a certain dimension and emotion to it. And it just shows how intelligent and intellectual he is as an artist. He really gets it and how to sit there and tell a story and make music. I love that. Should never have a favorite child But my Carly, just so crazy and wild My only daughter, she's daddy's girl And for her, I buy the whole ass to world But she don't want money, she just wants me there To watch her play piano or brush her hair And I know it's a million kids That feel the same pain that my children's in 45 years, cause they hate the G To break loose from this modern day slavery oh, They put us in the cage and make a minimum wage That's how this mother Fucking system was made. I lift weights, Ooh. I play handball, I write Carly, I write my grandma. I write the movie, and I'm sending a copy to Edward James Almost. These hoes can't stop me. You got vatos that cry for their mamas You got soldados that handle their biz You got people that can't recognize their kids oh. You got homies coming in on a straight five Put some work in, now we got a face live oh. That's 40 years before we up the road It's all in the sofa, he ain't coming home This is the belly of the beast, the semen jungle The drunk driver, they kill my homies, niece and uncle oh. Just walk right by me, should I straight throw him? Nah, homie, instead I'm gonna pray for him it's oh. peace. When this album hits the streets, they'll be pissed at me, cause I'm in history. I speak from the place, they stuck my race, but revenge oh. is the that was so I, lo I love the whole message behind this Okay, so I quickly want to talk about SPM with The Day of Unity. I love this track. I love when SPM gets in his bag and he sits here and taps into the raw inner emotion of how he's feeling and lays it all on the line and he becomes vulnerable with his fans and the general public because it shows the more human side and the more softer side of him where he's sitting there letting you know that he's human he's he's a he's a person and it takes away and it and it and it, and it sits there and takes away from sitting there trying to have any negative connotation a person may have of him because of how he sits there, how he sat there and had to live his life because of the hand he was sat there and dealt. Like a lot of people fail to realize that when you sit there and get played a hand, like you only can sit there and play the hand that you're dealt. It's like when you're sitting there playing spades. If you only sit there and got, you only sit there and have one spade, you can't sit there and throw in your hand because you still have that one spade. 
It's not like you sit there and don't have no spades. You still sit there and you have to make the most of what you have. And I feel like that's who what SPM embodies and that's who he is. He made the best of his circumstances and the life that he had to sit there and grow through, which is what a lot of us had to do out there. And that's why I don't cast any dispersions against who he is as a man or who he is as an individual or judge his survival because who am I to sit there and judge how he had to sit there and live, how he had to sit there and feed his family, how he had to sit there and feed himself, how he had to sit there and just feed anybody who had to sit there and eat. But it's like, or because I don't know his personal story, I don't know his personal struggle. So I sit there and like I always sit there and say, I remove myself from seeing what I've read about him and just judge the art. And when I can sit there and judge the art, I sit there and look at a man who is so phenomenal and so lyrically gifted and is so talented and is able to tell a story and do it with such perfection and such execution and such passion and raw emotion and such vulnerability. And like I said, I love when he gets in his bag and he jumps on tracks and do tracks like this where he sits there and shows the more softer side the more human element of him himself and to let people know who he is as a person to sit there and not judge his past life not to judge his court case or to judge who he is as a person and it, and it gives you an inside look as to who SPM is as a man it shows that he's not only an intellectual that he's actually a person who self-reflects and just thinks about life and how his life has shaped him and changed him as a man and how he's growing from what his past was and, and, and how it's progressing him into manhood and how it's changing him and making him want to be better not only for his daughter and maybe his other kids that he may have but also for his family for his baby mother and just in general for just anybody who who comes after him and just by the track of being called the day of unity he's just sitting there trying to basically show that we all need to come together we all need to unite and basically show and highlight how they fear and they and they're they feel threatened by when we come together and sit here and showcase our power because that's when you're most powerful when you're able to sit there and showcase your unity and show your togetherness they hate to sit there and see people together they rather sit there and use a divided conquer strategy where there's almost like a where you sit there and like i made this analogy before it's an us versus them mentality like where you sit there and have in spades it's us versus them they don't want to see you together and i love how spm attacks these tracks where he sits there and gets in his bag and he sits there and say no f all that we need to unite and get together and grow from the experience and yeah we may have had some some trials and tribulations that led us to the lives that we had to sit there and dealt go through but we have to sit there and be adults and live with those choices that we've made and grow from those experiences i love how he sat there and was able to do that and i love how he gets in his bag and he sits there and tells that story and i just think that he's an awesome awesome storyteller he's phenomenal he's amazing i love this i'm not rating this i think he did an absolutely phenomenal job with this track and with that being said i'm not gonna rate this so please let me know what you thought of spm the day of unity in the comments below like i said i love when spm gets in his bag and just annihilates tracks like this and just rips it because he showcases that he is that dude and why they because had why he hails as an equivalent to Tupac because he gets in his bag and he chefs it up and secures the bag and annihilates the game. He is so awesome and so dope. And with that being said, please remember to be safe out there. Remember to stay awesome. Be awesome because you guys are all awesome. This is your boy Mark and I'm signing off. Deuces. Peace. Call me Megatron. Johnny's a Megacon. It ain't about the race either. It's the marathon.